In this small laboratory in Ouagadougou, Burkina Faso, Gerald Neondiko is testing the effectiveness of Faso soap. It's a mosquito repelling soap made with essential oils. Developer Gerald Nyondiko says he came up with the idea when he noticed that malaria continued to spread despite mosquito nets and repellent sprays. Our goal is to save 100,000 lives by making this anti-mosquito soap available to the most vulnerable communities. If we were making sprays instead of soap, we would not have been able to reach our target. However, malaria causes many deaths amongst the poor. We want to reach those people who don't have a lot of money and have no other means of protection by providing them with a product that will not require any change in their habits at no extra expense. Neondiko says Faso soap repels mosquitoes for several hours after use. We want people to be protected from nightfall at about 6 p.m. until they go to bed. When the substances contained in the soap come into contact with the skin, they are there to the skin and aren't easily washed away. The first tests have proven conclusive. But financial challenges forced Neondiko to halt the project in 2015. Last year, a fundraising campaign brought in 70,000 US dollars, which has put Faso soap back on course. Comprehensive tests at the National Research Center against Malaria in Ouagadougou have begun. And Neondiko hopes to have the product approved by the World Health Organization. Susan Mongeli, CGTN.